Right, folks, that's a, a 4 3 win for the locals, but um, with Jonathan Smith here from Kerry Muir. Uh, Jonathan's up on a, on a ground tour. Tonight's number 37, and it's all about Frank's law. Jonathan, welcome to Inverurie. Tell us more about what you're up to. Thank you, Billy. I've been uh, touring 40 grounds for 40 years. I was 40 uh, in April last year, and I came up with a scheme. I thought I want to do something different from birthday, so I thought I'll visit 40 grounds, new grounds I've never been to before, go to a match, and uh, I've just been touring all over the country. In fact, just about all over the world. But it's, so uh-huh. it's been really good. Uh, the, the France Law campaign is getting uh, super publicity now. Um, I think it's it's a subject that's very close to people's hearts. Um, he was a player that was much loved. Those of us of a, of a certain vintage can remember him playing. Um, it must be something that you're really proud to be involved in. I am really proud to be involved in it. Uh, Frank and his family, Amanda and their son Scott, live in Kerry Muir uh, as well. And they've been customers of mine at, at my shop. And Amanda said, why don't you take a t-shirt? And I thought, that's a great idea. So I've been wearing it everywhere. And, and let's face it, uh, you know, disease doesn't discriminate against people by their age. And sadly, that's how it currently works. If you have a disease like dementia or a motor neuron disease, just for example, and you're under 65, then there is no free personal care. But if you're over 65, there's free personal care. So sadly for Frank, he died when he was 65, just two weeks. And then after, and that was six years that they had to, his family had to, to pay for personal care to, to get him through. So yeah, it's something I, f- I feel strongly about. And uh, that's hopefully we'll get the Scottish Government and maybe even the Westminster Government to think about it as well, right. get sorted out. Uh, tonight, I believe, was ground number 37. Correct. Um, when are you looking to, to hit the magic 40? Uh, I'm looking to hit the magic 40 before the 26th of April, which is my 41st birthday. And I really need to get it finished because my wife's had enough. <laughs> and uh, no, it's been great, but I'm, I'm looking forward to getting there. But we're nearly there. So uh, Harlow tonight. Funnily enough, we're going to be up to the Mosset next week to, to see Forest Mechanics against for Martin United. Uh, and then the last couple, I've not decided yet. I've got to try and do a special one. I said I would take my wife and kids to the last one. So hopefully soon, uh, but I'll, I'll announce that soon enough. Uh, the, the folk at Forest will take good care of you. It's a, a super club and really well run. So they'll be looking out for you when you go up the road. Well, this is the, this is the second time I've seen them on the road tonight. I saw them play Strathspey earlier in the season. Uh, uh, up in Grant and Space, so that was that was a great night. So we're really looking forward to going up to to to, to the Mosset. And to be honest, we've been to quite a f- I've been to quite a few Highland League grounds on this tour, and I have to say I can't praise the standard of football enough, and also the friendly welcome that you get. So definitely highly recommend to anyone that fancies a Highland League game. Well worth it. Oh, you certainly want to beat the Highland League for <laughs> for thrills, that's for sure. <laughs> no, definitely. Um, I believe at some point in the future, all the signed tops, including one from uh, ourselves, they're all going to be auctioned off, aren't they, for the campaign? That's correct. That's what Amanda's hoping to do. So uh, once collect up a few more, then we'll, they'll be getting auctioned off and the money will go to helping, oh. well, either to raise awareness or to make sure that Frank's law is, is made law. Scott, it's been super uh, to have you in Inverurie tonight and we wish you all the best for the rest of your tour. Thanks again. Thank you very much, Billy.